<laughs> Hello, this is Borna from Borna.TV, and today I want to talk about Warframe and Nightwave. Nightwave is a new feature that hit Warframe uh, yesterday, which replaces the alert system. Now, one of the big complaints about the alert system from a lot of players is that alerts tend to happen every hour, right? But you may see things like Forma and Potatoes and things like that, uh, Catalyst and whatnot that may occur like in the middle of the night when you're asleep. And uh, a lot of people have applications that will alert them. If a Forma pops up, they'll wake up, they'll go to the alert, get the Forma, they go back to sleep. It wasn't the, a perfect system, but it worked for many, many years. So Warframe has completely scrapped the alert system and they've introduced this new Nightwave system, which, you know, a lot of us, including myself, kind of akin to like a sort of a battle pass. They're daily and weekly challenges that you can do. Like for example, you can deploy a glyph, you get a thousand uh, reputation towards the Wolf of Saturn Six, and you get a whole bunch of cool things uh, from rewards as you do these different things. You got, you know, full of socket, the uh, Ayatan sculpture, complete bounties. These are like things you would normally do: scans for Cephalon Samaris, kill 500 enemies, so on and so forth. For the weeklies, you can see that there's some elite weeklies, there's some weeklies, and there's some dailies. So the different levels of things now. Before you get into the, the, the obvious conclusion that, hey, Buana, this thing's going to be super grindy. Oh, my gosh. Warframe adding more grind. Uh, uh, DE has already said, uh, re specifically Rebecca has already said that um, you really don't have to play a whole lot to get everything done. Uh, you don't have to you don't have to grind day in and day out to get to level 30. From what she said, it's a casual pace. And if you do, I believe it was, she said 60 to 65 percent of the activities you'll get the level 30 and the rewards are pretty awesome um i'm, not, I'm just gonna go right to the thing uh, the, the thing well, what's the thing the umbra forma this will allow you to apply the umbra polarity now <laughs> if you if you if, if you haven't done the quest for umbra i'm sorry i'm not going to spoil you too much but some items came from that which had some umbra related modules and <laughs> they're really good and some people you know they, they really want to put them on other frames so now you can with the first of many umbra formas there's forma bundles there's some wolf house oh look there's arcane energize and some of these modules are kind of insane sick and crazy look at this napalm grenades on the penta it it, it, it leaves a, a burning patch on impact and it gets a plus 30 to base status chance Ooh. and then this one right here bursting mass that's pretty good i'll let you read that one but this is probably the one i mean i'm gonna turn to klim gregata gregata klim <laughs> secondary fire will shoot with 400 fire rate until the magazine is empty you get that right 400 fire rate and then if you kill two or more enemies it will refund the ammo oh gosh it's just gonna be complete and total Brrr. it's just gonna be forever gregata everywhere I'm definitely going to be building my twin gricadas with that. Um, I don't know if it'll work on twin gricadas. It's, it says gricada. I haven't done any of this yet, but I do plan on jumping on this on Friday. Lots of cool rewards. Warframe's Battle Pass, the Wolf of Saturn Six. There's a nice little, uh, a nice little lore associated with. It. If you click tune in down here, you get a sense of what the radio show was all about and uh, what this radio host is asking. She's calling us dreamers. Nora Knight, she's calling us dreamers and she's encouraging us to complete these tasks and she will reward these activities, which is essentially a battle pass. And I, I, I gotta say, battle passes from Fortnite have been proven to work. People come back to the game to play, to complete battle passes. And you know, Apex Legends is getting a battle pass. Pretty much everybody's getting a battle pass. Battle Rights got a battle pass. It's the thing for free to play games. It keeps you coming back and it keeps you playing the game and it gives you fresh rewards and cosmetics and i actually think it's a good idea so kudos to digital extremes and warframe for giving us a reason to come back because i was taking a little bit of a hiatus occasionally i take hiatuses from the game so i don't get burned out because there was a little bit of a little bit of a delay in um i guess you say new content after fortuna part two came out so i was like i'll take a little break i'll play it a couple times a week but now, you know, this is an incentive to play almost every day, if not more times a week, to complete this wolf of Saturn 6. This is Borna from Borna TV. Click that bell. You know, click that subscribe button if you like the video. Then click the bell. Click the bell. Just remember that. Click the bell. <laughs> Check out my Patreon at patreon.com slash Borna. Please, please support the stream. This is how I make a living, and you guys' support is always welcome. Have a great day, and I'll see you next time.